Don, this morning on Investor Talk, you clarified to our audience that lithium is used for more than just EV battery materials. Can you expand on that, please? Yeah, one of the main uses from the past has always been uh, in high strength glass ceramic products. And the way they like to introduce lithium into the batch formulation is using the high purity lithium aluminum silicate mineral pedalite. And it's actually the mineral that Corning used to invent Corningware cookware, which was one of the first examples of a high strength glass ceramic product. But that's a business that's been growing and growing now. And, and there's more and more innovation on other types of high strength glass ceramic products. And um, I see it being potentially used in electric vehicles in the uh, future as well as, as a part of the light weighting of the electric vehicle by using it in the um, windshields. So it's going to be more and more innovation and more and more demand for uh, minerals like this that have the high purity requirements to meet the needs of the uh, manufacturers. And um, we don't have one in Canada yet, but it'd be nice to be able to attract one of the manufacturers uh, here now too, to take advantage of our natural resource wealth and abundance of these types of resources that can meet their needs on future glass ceramic products. Your announcement, you had an announcement on this just yesterday. Would you like to expand on that? Yeah, well, we've had other um, expressions of interest and I finally got an offtake commitment firmed up with one major international glass ceramic manufacturer. They didn't want us to disclose who they were and where they're located, but they're a big player that has been one of the innovators on uh, new types of um, high strength glass products, including one that's high strength flexible glass saw it and it's amazing stuff you can bend it but you cannot break it amazing and then yep. now there's other interests because of the lack of supply so all the major manufacturers are reaching out asking us to when we can send a sample don you were all over the press last week with your the historic canadian Korean signing that happened with LG Energy Solutions. And Avalon was one of the three companies they had elected to make a deal with. Can you tell us more about that deal and congratulations? Yeah, well, basically we've been getting the message out on our vision for creating the um, lithium battery materials refiner in Thunder Bay. And that would be an ideal location to serve the needs of um, companies that are now going to set up manufacturing facilities in Southern Ontario. And as you're probably aware, LG are planning to set up a battery manufacturing facility in the Windsor area. And so it'll be very easy for us to be able to create the supply for them to help them get uh, started there. And that's one of the things the government has been promising is that they will support creating the critical material supply chains in order to attract these manufacturers to set up and take advantage of the access to them here in um, Ontario and elsewhere in Canada. I know your schedule's incredibly intense right now. Critical minerals are all over the all over the news, and you've been a leader in that sector for as long as I can recall. In fact, our company was created as a result of an interview with you in 2008. So Don, can you tell us what we should anticipate in this next coming quarter other than what appears to be a pattern for you, which is news every week? Tell us more. Well, we'll probably be able to um, get more news flow out as we do more and more agreements with um, end users and then hopefully we'll also get a deal finalized with LG and maybe one of the EV manufacturers to support our aspirations on getting the lithium battery materials refinery established in uh, Thunder Bay and get the deal closed on acquiring the site for it so we can um, get that ball rolling and that will be a very significant news event when we get it out.
for those of you out there going, oh my goodness, I need to know more about Avalon Advanced Materials, please go to their website or send us an email and we'll send it over to their team. Thank you, Don, for joining us today. My pleasure.